you, Mark. It's the 25th year of Coca-Cola. Christmas in the park. The Auckland event is on tomorrow, and it's going to be hosted by none other than our own Mike Puru and also the truly inspirational Jess Quinn, who joins us right now. It's great to have you back on the show. Yeah. yeah. Good to be here. It's really, it's really nice to have you. Can we just quickly say, what were you saying to the words of that song when we had the intro yes. was playing? All I want no, for Christmas is... No, Mike Peru. All I want for Christmas is Mike Peru. Okay. There's only one person that's ever said that line. So that's what you're dealing with, Jess. Oh, I know. I'm there for you now. Um, but first up, what a huge year for you. Third yes. Dancing with the Stars. Um, you've been doing some modelling. You've been doing a whole lot of things. How's the time passed? What's been going on? The time has literally just gone by. This I don't know where 2018 went. As mm -hmm. you say, it started with Dancing with the Stars and then I went to LA to model and then I came back to New Zealand Fashion Week wow. and then I did a TED Talk, which was really cool. And then wrapping up the year like this. It's amazing. Fantastic. I, I saw some New Zealand park. Fashion Week. You did the Jockey Show. I did the Jockey Show. I did the Stolen Girlfriends Club show, which was my first runway, which was really exciting. Yeah. Now for those, Jess, uh, that don't know how it all began, Began, mm -hmm. You know, you're an influencer to hundreds of thousands of people. <laughs> was there one pivotal moment that, that, you know, happened? Yeah, there was for me. I did a photo shoot that I just wanted to do because I wanted to speak out about body image and just using real people in media and advertising. And the photo shoot went viral. I got about 10,000 followers overnight. And now, two years later, 188,000, I think. And yeah, it's just been a whole journey that's led to Dancing with the Stars, which has led to something else. And I just... Mm. Don't know where it's going to keep Are going. Are you quite conscious about the fact that you've got all these young women and young girls following you and, and watching your every word and move? Yeah, definitely. I um, I know how influential it can be following people on, on Instagram and, and just around life, so I'm really conscious of the message I put out there, mm -hmm. but that's that's what I want to use my platform to do is put out a positive, happy message. So. And you've done that brilliantly as well. I mean, you know, one of the things that you spoke out about this year was photoshopping and how that affects, you know, young ladies. Where are you with that now? Do you think the industry have listened to you? I think they're getting there. It's actually going to be my main focus for next year, and it's the focus of my TED Talk. So once my TED Talk launches, I think there's going to be a wave of that conversation, which I'm really excited Excellent. for. Excellent. Hey, and speaking of lots of young people, lots of young people are going to be at Christmas at the park yeah. watching you guys host the <laughs> yeah. show. Now, with Mike, you've just got to basically um, just say yes, Mike, and do what you okay. want anyway. Okay. That's okay. what we do. That's I need do. all the tips I can get. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's, he's an absolute dream to work with. You have a great time. Oh, thanks, Mel. Yeah, so what are you looking forward to? Um, just the whole experience. I've been really wanting to get into presenting, so to be able to do that in front of a whole lot of kids and families is amazing, alongside Mike Pro obviously is an honour so it, it is an honour you know and that is the thing too because it's a, such an iconic event in New Zealand you not only get the experience at the park at the, at the domain but you also get the experience on TV for yeah. those of you that can't make it December the 15th mm -hmm. it'll be on three mm -hmm. um, you know, can you remember going to your first Christmas in the park and yeah. that feeling that happened you yeah know? can you describe it did you enjoy it yeah I've always loved Christmas in the park and for me it's a kind of it's early December so it gets you into the Christmas spirit and it's been something that my family my parents and my sisters we've always done and and it's, it's just exciting. Awesome. And now you're yeah. going to be there again this year, but you're going to be on the I stage. I know. I never thought it would happen. Without Here icon. <laughs> I can't call, can call you a legend. I know. Her year's just got so much better now she gets to work with me. You see, <laughs> capped it off brilliantly. So, all the acts, so who's involved? Do you both know like, yeah. who's involved? Yeah. Do you want to... You can, Okay, well, and we've then got we're going to do a duo uh, song together. <laughs> and, <laughs> and, and dance. <laughs> no, no, basically we're going to be introducing some incredible people. Stan Walker's the headliner, which is fantastic. But we've also got Lavina Williams. We've got Vince Harder. Cool. Uh, you know, we've got so many acts. And this is the good thing about Christmas in the Park. They audition from around New Zealand. So you get to see a whole lot of talented people that you yeah. quite often don't get to see. Yeah, and all the dance crews come together. And, you know, there's young kids who have talent that just blows my mind oh, and amazing. puts my dancing to shame, that's for sure. So are you um, dancing? Oh, yeah. I'm not planning on it. They asked me that on the phone. They're like, you're cool to dance, right? And I was like, the nation has seen enough of me dancing. Yeah, Jess is definitely going to dance. Just make, you can make a dance. That could be your job. And are you going to get Mike to sing? Oh, you don't I'm definitely dance. getting Mike to sing. He will definitely be doing that anyway because he loves to bust out in tune. Um, and what about Santa? Who's Santa? Yes. Is it true that Mikey Havoc is going to be sent? Really? Is yes. It? Yes, it is. There you go. You didn't know that, Jess, did know you? That. No, that's right. That's why we work together on these things. No, Mikey Havoc as Santa. For those of you who don't that's know really Mikey cool. Havoc, um, Push Push was his band. Go Google him. Legend. Yeah, go Google him. Excellent. Hey, we'll Can't to wait, Mark. Jess. Thank you. Yeah, there he is. There's Mikey Havoc. <laughs> there he is on screen right now. I'm best of luck. Really looking Thank forward you. to seeing you guys on screen uh, and in person this Saturday. Auckland's Coca-Cola Christmas in the Park takes place tomorrow night at the Domain. You can check out the website for further details. 
details. All proceeds from money raised at the event are going to go to Youthline, who do such a great job helping to support and develop over 50,000 young people every year. And the Kiwi Christmas Concert of the Year is going to screen next Saturday, the 15th of December, 7 o'clock on 3. Yes, I can't wait. We'll see you tomorrow, Jess.